Council Area Urban League is in its 22nd year of providing shoes to Knox County students in need. The goal is to make sure they have their back to school basics and are ready for the upcoming school year. 10 News reporter Lauren Davis joins us now with more on the expectations ahead of this year's event. Lauren. John Robin Shoes for School is a month away and there are big changes coming, including where it is and what they are offering. I spoke to an Urban League leader about why this event keeps evolving. The Knoxville Area Urban League is aiming to give out more than 1,700 free pairs of shoes this year to kids aged 5 to 12. Carly Hammonds, the Director of Education and Youth Services for the organization, says the event helps kids in school. Those shoes help to alleviate the need to compare themselves to their peers so they're able to focus on their academic rigor and goals. Um, we find that youth perform a whole lot better when they feel a part of um, their peers. This year's event will take place at a new location, the Jacob Building in Chilhowee Park. In addition to shoes and school supplies, there will be other services available this year too. A longtime partner of ours, the Barbering Academy um, here in Knoxville, will be providing free haircuts for young men and young men, women that are in attendance for shoes for school. And the event isn't just for kids. We want to make sure that parents and guardians have the resources that they need um, to elevate their career, to make sure that they have health insurance, and then also be aware of some of the black owned businesses and minority businesses that we have here in Knoxville. Hammonds says the goal of Shoes for School is about making sure students and their families are as prepared as they can be. If we can alleviate those social barriers, they can perform better academically, but also relieving those barriers for families as well so they can reallocate funding to more uh, pressing issues that they may be facing. Shoes for School has reached capacity, so the sign up is closed. However, people are still encouraged to attend to take advantage of the free school supplies, the employment and vendor fair, health resources, and more. Sponsors are also still needed to buy the shoes and pay for the event. Should be a fun day, Lauren. Thank you. Well,